Well, I finally got my empennage kit, and this is the first video I'm actually putting out. So, this is me unloading everything. The camera work probably needs a little bit of work, or a lot of work, I'm not really sure. Um, but basically, the kit comes all wrapped up in paper. There's like, literally like a 50 gallon drum worth of paper that it all comes in. There's my dog. And you'll see me just kind of putting parts on the on the table there. Unwrapping stuff, getting it ready to be counted. I will save you the pain and not video me counting each rivet and bolt and nut. But I did do that. Um, and believe it or not, there was like three things missing. There was a <coughs> there was a bolt missing. Um, a couple of rivets and one other thing, but very small things. I contacted Van, sent him a note and with pictures and whatnot, and they said, not a problem, we'll send it to you. So I'm just waiting for that stuff to get here, but it wasn't a problem at all. They even give you a book. It's kind of nice. Started reading it. It's very interesting. That's my neighbor. He came. Over, I've been talking about this airplane for a while, and it finally came. So he was, he's like, "Hey, there's your plane." So he came over and visited with us. That is my daughter. She came and she was excited. She is actually going to be getting her pilot's license here in the next uh, year or so. Uh, my wife and the kids just showed up. That's me raising my hands, being excited. I was a little bit excited to get this project started. So. I was having fun. The box that it comes in is a, a rather sturdy wood box um, with a million and a half staples. Um, so I was taking out the staples just to make sure I could save the wood and not uh, puncture any tires or anything with those staples. So that's just me taking those staples out. Oh, and there's my Dr. Pepper. It'd be awesome if Dr. Pepper uh, sponsored me and I would paint my plane Dr. Pepper colors. I love Dr. Pepper. There's the dog again inspecting my work. And now I'm trying to figure out where in the world I'm going to put this thing so I can get the van back in the garage. There are some pieces and parts kind of taped down to the bottom there. Um, little pieces uh, that I <coughs> just unhooked and found room for. And then I cleaned up a little bit. I had some uh, little pieces of carpet. I got that, see that gray carpet on that corner of that table that's sticking out there at the bottom. Um, I got some gray carpet just to make it a little bit easier on the aluminum. Um, but I was cleaning up the mess after doing that so I could get stuff kind of situated in the garage. And then here towards the end, I asked my girls to help me move my big crate. And they'll show up here in a couple of seconds. There they are. They're going to help me move it over to the other side. That is not where it's going to stay, but it's where it is for now. <clears throat> 